Finally. Oh, I forgot my phone. I can't take Instagram. That's all right. We can't get a boom. Wait, let me go get my phone. It is the last big shipment, and it's like the one I wanted the most. I know. <laughs> Almost the most expensive. Definitely the most exciting. So who gets to uh, break them in first? Well, I'm touching every oh, pair for us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna lick all the handles, yeah. It'll be like one of those old uh, cigarette commercials. You remember those where they'd like lick the trash can? Yeah. No, I can't find them, and no Not one else remembers that commercial. Cat. I know, I remember, yeah, I remember them. Yeah, they were like fast forward and licking them. Yeah. yeah. That it flat right there is not so fun. Nice. Oh, dang, they're pretty compacted in. Yeah, because yeah, the bill says one, one handling unit, so this yeah. is be your only one. Alright. Why do they look green? I don't know, but I like them. I did too. They're it's looking, like looking yeah. beautiful. <laughs> Griffin's mid squats, but he's helping. And they're all here. All 20 pair. Thanks to everybody helping out. Griffin even shed some blood for this one. Excited to kind of see these pushed up against the mirrors once the mirrors are here. Those should be here I think late next week. But uh, come together, I'll probably do a quick gym tour either later this afternoon or another day to kind of wrap up this video. But uh, it's nice to kind of finally have these in. It's kind of like the last equipment piece coming in. All right, so it has been a while since I've picked up the camera and I feel like so much has changed and I've kind of posted a little bits and pieces but it's almost like every time I, I post an update whether it's on YouTube or Instagram within a day or two things look different so I'm gonna walk you through the gym today and show you some of the updates uh, so we'll start with the front desk area and one thing you'll notice and I'll throw pictures up on the screen now of the signs so we got a sign kind of in the front of our entire building and we got our sign here on our actual door with our hours and logo as well of course it's reversed because I'm on the inside and then looking into the front desk area, it's really coming along. So we got this front desk built that my dad has been working on the past two weekends. So I'm really liking how this is. We're going to have our logo in this kind of metallic aluminum right there on the front, which will look nice. We have the energy drink fridge that will sit up there on top, along with our computer that we'll have for checking in people and signing them up. We have a few products right there that will probably go on a shelf around this wall. And then down here... It's a little bit of a work in progress still, but we got clothing racks. Just some Gym Flow shirts thrown up there for now, but of course we'll have some Iron Belt shirts in a few weeks or so to go up there as well. Moving on into the main kind of gym floor area in the machine room. So in the last video you saw us put together this big old eight stack cable station and that took a bit, but I'm really liking it. And we've had a lot of new attachments come in as far as, you know, we've had our mag grips over here, but we also got a few ropes and other things like a lap pull down bar and other uh, attachments are coming over time. So just waiting on a lot of those to ship and get here. And of course they'll be here by the time we open. So, and one thing I do have to do is replace this cable right here. I think I mentioned in the last video, but it was frayed. So we got another cable right there. But uh, that's a little bit more work than I expected to kind of get the pieces and, and get that set up right, basically. Other than that, we got the flags up there at the top, which I think look really nice. We're also going to have a law enforcement and firefighting flag put up very soon as well. Uh, I think the machines are generally the same. We have the USA flag up there, and we got a donated Virginia state flag we're going to put up there as well. Not much has changed besides the dumbbells coming in the freeway area, although I just got confirmation this morning they called Maddie, and the mirrors will be here tomorrow being Tuesday. So in the next video I post, that'll probably really kind of liven up the room. You'll be able to see yourself flex, pose, do all that jazz. And then also I think the mirrors will just make the place look a little bit bigger as well, and really just make it look like a gym. So Austin's breaking in some dumbbells. Really happy with these. Liking them, digging them. One thing I have noticed is these little uh, labels on these caps are kind of coming off. But that's just because they were kind of rushed out very fast. And all it takes is like a dab of super glue and they're back on. So 
no big deal with that. Loving those, loving the aesthetic. I think again, once they're against the mirrors and with the black walls, it'll look very great in here. So that's most of the update as far as those. And real brief thing about the dumbbells because I didn't really touch on it in the earlier clips when they were coming in. I didn't really have a chance to gather my thoughts was why we went with this kind of iron pro style chrome cap type aesthetic rather than a rubber cap. And the reason is mostly just that, it's the aesthetic, it's the look. It's kind of old school, but still keeping it clean and modern as well. So I like the kind of balance. I also thought it would look good against the black walls rather than everything being black, black, black. So I really do like the chrome cap look and the uh, iron dumbbells to go along with the whole kind of theme of the place. So it's a lot of iron and silver and gray in this building, along with a lot of, uh, you know, just satin black. So I think it looks good. In the turf area, not much has changed as well, although we're getting materials to build the deadlift platforms today. So those will be, again, probably in the next video and very soon posted. Uh, but we also got edging for this turf. We haven't put it on yet, but we're gonna have an edge go all the way down and on the outline of it to just make it look a little cleaner, uh, make it look a little bit nice, a little better transition from the turf to the floor. One small thing too, although I don't know if I touched on this, is this wall-mounted chalk bowl. And then also a little rack for the bumper plates that we do have. So nice little organization. And then over here, my dad's been working on this big old cubby space because what we're going to have is the cubbies against that wall. We're going to have a bench kind of most of this distance, basically. And so it'll be a nice spot for people to kind of sit, warm up, gather themselves, hang out for a bit before they get out and uh, lift some heavy stuff. And last thing I'll touch on this little rack up here organizing the bands and such and I think I'm gonna build something to organize the foam rollers as well so a little bit of an update um, excited again about the dumbbells that come, came in that was just a long time coming but I hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure you like subscribe I'm a little bit slow with putting out content recently but so much is happening it's hard for me to kind of just like take a second grab the camera and talk about it but uh, a lot of fine details are coming as far as the deadlift platforms the wall decals um, decorative items things like that are coming so keep an eye out make sure you're following the gym page at iron built gym on instagram and uh, uh a lot of work a lot of work a lot of little things that you would not expect but it's all part of the journey loving every day here catch you guys later